everybody, Dangerous Minds here. I'm just interrupting everything that's going on at the moment because there's been an update, so-called, in the Madeleine McCann case. Now, I'm not sure how many of you were following that, but because I, I know a lot of my subs are crime people um, related to the, my Kessinger episodes, I'm just going to put something in about Madeleine McCann. I don't think there's anything to this latest development. It, in fact, it was predicted by Gonzalo Amaral, the uh, Portuguese detective that the McCanns sued and lost that case, who released a book, the, the Truth of the Lie. And I think what's happened is this is an opportune moment. I think it's politicised. I think it's to divert attention away from all the problems that the government's facing at the moment. The um, coronavirus fiasco is blowing up in their face over in the UK. There's protests in support of George Floyd. Uh, everything is just going batshit crazy for, for the government over there. And this is a perfect time to pull out the Madeleine McCann flag to say hey stop what you're doing look at this but I don't think the UK public are going to buy it not in not in general I don't think they believe the media on this anymore not the mainstream media I think they're smart enough to have uh, researched it and got everything that they need from sources that are well documented and well investigated online and nobody believes the media line, not 100% anyway, and they've just been saying the same thing over and over again with no um, investigation other than believing the McCann story, which when you look into it is totally unfounded and there's no factual basis behind it, at least no evidence that can be produced. So I think it's just a political move and the former lead investigator... Um, that wrote the book about the truth of the lie and how he believed Madeline died in that hotel room and certainly the evidence seems to back it up and it makes the most sense because it fits everything there there's nothing that it doesn't fit which means that that is most the most likely scenario also the dogs hitting in the area that he established that she could have fallen and and, and died or been placed um, I think they gave her drugs of some kind um, because that's what they were doing. They were going out, having a good time at night. They were doctors. And I just, I think there was a, it was a monumental mistake on their part. And they just like the money and keep it going. And cognitive dissonance, denial, I don't know why. They just don't come clean. But um, that's another story in itself. But basically this, this suspect is just... A patsy putting up as a scapegoat to try and divert attention off what's going on. And once again, poor little Maddie is just being used. In those podcasts, Gonzalo says they will fit up a German pedophile. And I think this is an opportune moment to pull out that card and get some heat off the UK government. That's my opinion. And unless something truly revelational comes, comes along, that's how I'm going to see it because I've done research into this and I just can't see it any other way at this point.